Hey Giants fans, Sean O'Hara here, and it's time for this week's Closer Look, presented by Microsoft Surface. The Giants had five takeaways, and I know everybody's focusing on all of those turnovers that they created, but we are going to take a closer look at the run defense. They've done a great job up front being stout, and when you look at what they did against the Washington football team, they held them to 39 yards. When you can stuff the run like that, you basically turn them into a one-dimensional offense. Now, they've done it collectively, but you've got to give props to the big fellas up front. Dexter Lawrence had a tackle for a loss. Leonard Williams had a tackle for a loss, and he's been downright unblockable. So they've done a great job along with uh, B.J. Hill, Dalvin Tomlinson, even Austin Johnson getting in on the action. And then on the perimeter, Kyla Frackler has been a, doing a great job on the outside. Devontae Downs has been getting in on it. Of course, they funnel everything to Blake Martinez, who has consistently been a tackling machine week in and week out. It's not just this last week, though. When you look at this Giants defense, boy, they've done a great job. For four weeks in a row now, they've held their opponent to under 100 yards rushing. That's phenomenal. Now, I mentioned the, the front handling their business. The linebackers doing a great job on the second level. But any good run defense is only as good as their safety insert. And Jabril Peppers has been playing very physical football. He loves running downhill. He's been making phenomenal tackles in space, but he's doing a great job of coming off the edge along with Logan Ryan and a lot of their blitz package stuff. So a really great job on all three levels defensively of stuffing the run, shutting everything down. They've been doing a great job of playing on the other team's side of the line of scrimmage. And that's this week's Closer Look.